Hi, my friends. Welcome. Cindy Devotney, Monday Mentor Moment. And I got news for you. I don't take it personally if you don't like me. I mean, I think sometimes people take things too personally. Now, I hope all of you like me. And I do have a lot of people that say they love me. And I get a lot of love. And do you not think it hurts my feelings if you say you don't like me? Yeah, probably. But I have learned I am not taking things that personally. You know, recently I was chatting with a friend. And it's like sports fans. I mean, sometimes I get really a chuckle because they go crazy. You know, as football season starts or when baseball season starts, everybody, you'll see them with the banners on their car and, you know, everything like they just, every, it's like, I live for this team. And I think to myself, the team doesn't even know you. Do you work for the team? No, you don't work for the team. And they don't even know you. And then when they lose the World Series or they lose the Super Bowl, you, they talk about it for days. They go on and on and on and their life is disastrous and they complain and then they get in fights with their friends who are with the other team. And I laugh at that. I'm like, why are you fighting with a friend about a baseball team or a football team? That team doesn't give a rip about you. And yet you're going to defend it. Now, my husband will tell you that's because he's a fan or that's because they're a fan. And fans take this very personally. Okay, I get it. Maybe it's just because I'm not that big a fan. I will fight for my family. I'll fight for my friends because I know they actually care about me. But that team, they don't know me and they don't care about me. I can root for them. I can have a little party. I can wear their jersey. But at the end of the day, if they blow it, shame on them. I wasted money on that jersey but I don't take it personally. And that brings me to what the world's going through. I mean, we are so divided. We are so divided over politics and vaccines and all these things. And I gotta tell you, you gotta stop taking it personally because really, who cares about you? And what are you going to do to take care of yourself and those around you? You have to make some decisions to not go deep into the pity pool and constantly stress out and get yourself so worked up that you can't even have a conversation with a friend or family member. So let's try for this entire week not to take anything too personally. Sure, if somebody is really downright mean to you and they're a friend or a family member, go ahead, look them in the face and tell them to snap out of it. But otherwise, give a smile, give a wink, and keep on walking.